Hey everybody, hope you're all having a great holiday season. It's a really fun, special time of year, so I hope you're all enjoying it. Uh, first off, I just wanted to say a big thank you to all of my new subscribers and my new friends and everyone who's commented and left me messages and profile comments. Um, really appreciate it. It's so, it's so awesome to me that it's growing so fast and, you know, I couldn't be where I am without you guys supporting me, so I really, really appreciate it. Um, unfortunately, I did not make it into the potential finalist category for the YouTube Symphony audition, so that ship has sailed without me. <laughs> so um, I just want to say a big congratulations, though, to everybody who auditioned and everybody who made it into the potential finalist category. And good luck to everybody. I hope it's great. I hope you have fun in Sydney. Um, it's going to be great no matter what. So. Just congratulations to everybody and just for putting yourselves out there and doing the audition because it, it wasn't easy, it was long and a lot of pieces to learn. So um, I'm so glad that I did it because I got a chance to show you guys some more of my classical playing and some harder pieces than are usually on my channel. So it was still really fun to do and I'm uh, really glad that I did it. But unfortunately I will not be a part of it. Hi Hunter. My dog has decided to join me. Um, I wanted to say something about my messages. Um, first of all, thank you if you've sent me a message. Um, unfortunately, I'm trying really hard to keep up with all the messages, but sometimes um, I'll just have like a spare couple of minutes and I'll read through them and then I'll forget to respond to some of them. And I try as hard as I can to respond, but um, if, I've, if I've forgotten to respond to you, I'm really sorry because I know how it feels to have people not respond to you, and it doesn't feel good. And I certainly don't want to do that to any of you guys, especially since most of you are sending really nice messages, very supportive messages. So if I haven't sent you something back and you still have a question that's unanswered or something, please feel free to send me another message and maybe just put on there, hey, I already sent you something, but you didn't respond. And I will definitely um, try my hardest to make sure that I respond that time. So again, I'm sorry. I'm just getting a lot more messages, and it's kind of hard to keep up with it all. So um, just resend something if you still have an unanswered question. I'd really appreciate that. And also, if you have a song suggestion, um, I would really appreciate it if you didn't send me a link, because now I'm getting a lot more spam mail, too. And so I'm a little hesitant sometimes to click on the links, but I really want to hear your guys' suggestions. I mean, I'm learning so many cool new pieces just because you guys are suggesting things that I haven't heard before so maybe just send me the title and just some extra information about it if it's like a special rendition or something and then I'll do a YouTube search myself and then that way I can you know still see the song but then kind of protect my computer and everything so I would really appreciate that um, I wanted to say oh also um, <laughs> my neighbor Laura um, she's the one who you see in some of my earlier videos with me doing some lovely piano playing. Um, she and I did some Christmas songs together and so I'm in the process right now of editing all of that together and um, I'm hopefully going to put some of them on iTunes for next week. I know it's getting kind of close to the Christmas season but I'm just working as fast as I can to get it all done. But um, yeah, so I'll, I'll let you guys know if I can get those up for next week and then maybe you can check some of them out. Um, I'll probably put some on my page too so you can listen to them. So hope you guys enjoy those if I can get them up. Um, I wanted to do a couple of frequently asked questions as well. Um, one of them that I've gotten a lot is, do I actually play the video games or do I just like the music? And the answer is both. Um, for most of the songs that I've done, I think a lot have been Final Fantasy. I've played a lot of the Final Fantasy games. I've played 7, 8, 9, 10. Didn't play the online one. I think that was 11. I played 12. And I started 13, but I haven't really gotten past the Frozen Lake yet. So uh, I haven't played that one in a while. But um, yeah, I love the Final Fantasy games. That was definitely my favorite series. Played Chrono Trigger, Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2. I didn't play Birth by Sleep. I think that was PSP. I only have PlayStation 2, not a PSP. So. Um, yeah, I've played a lot of the games that I do the music for, but I haven't played Chrono Cross and might be a couple of other ones in there, but I do plan on doing some Metal Gear Solid because I've heard some of that soundtrack because of your um, suggestions, and it has some great music, so I haven't played those games, but I still plan on doing some music from those. Um, yeah, so I definitely 
have gamed quite a bit in the past. Um, I always said if I had spent as much time playing the video games as, um, or as much time practicing my violin as I had played the video games, then I'd probably be good enough to be in an orchestra right now. <laughs> but unfortunately, um, not unfortunately though, I had a really good time in my childhood playing those games, so it was really fun. Um, also, I've had a lot of questions about how I record, and so I'm sure if you've been watching my channel for a while, you've seen that it's it's changed a lot. Um, I've actually changed violins since I started my channel. I upgraded a couple months ago, and it's a much nicer instrument, so um, that has something to do with it from the beginning till uh, what you see now in my later videos. And also, um, I have started recording since I think One Winged Angel um, with an external microphone and that has made a big difference. Um, the internal microphones on the cameras, like the one that I'm recording with now, is just, it doesn't treat the violin very well and frankly, like, it, just recording a violin in general is very difficult. I've read so much about it and I still can't figure it out really. So, uh, I'm still doing a work in progress, but I'll just tell you guys what I've learned. Um, I've learned that if you put the microphone, it's not supposed to be a close mic because then you can hear a lot of the bow noises, um, like about here, if I'm playing like this, um, above and to the right of the violin, that seems to be a nice sweet spot. Uh, and also it kind of depends on the acoustics of the room. And I add some artificial reverb in my um, software once I've recorded because I've switched uh, venues in my house uh, and it, it's a little bit better. but. Um, a lot of a lot of the websites say that artificial reverb is definitely the best way to go. So um, I do a lot of that too. And um, as far as an external microphone, I don't think it really matters. Some people say condenser. Some people say ribbon. I have a condenser, I believe. Um, but it just really depends. You just have to play around with it a lot. And I'm certainly no master. I have plenty more to learn. So. Just uh, trying my best, and you know, if you guys have any more questions than that, then I'll, I'll try to help you out. But if not, just um, there's some great forums out there, and that's that's all I've done. I don't have any friends or any relatives that are in this recording business or anything, so I've just been searching on my own and have found some decent information. So that's where I get it. And um, one more thing, I'm hoping to have a Christmas gift for you guys. Um, I'll probably do. Another little video on Christmas, hopefully, if it's to the point where I want it to be. Some of you can probably guess what it is, but I won't tell. Um, so I just have to wait till Christmas. Um, but yeah, that's all. So I just wanted to give this update to you guys. If anyone's still watching, this is getting really long. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but yeah, I just, again, thank you so much for all your support. Um, the YouTube page has meant a lot to me. I never really thought that I would be the type of person to have a YouTube page because I'm a little more reserved um, and I always looked at that as kind of like you know you're showing off or something but um, I've met so many just wonderful people and wonderful other musicians it's really been an awesome experience for me and you guys have definitely made it that amazing experience for me so thank you so much it's definitely been a big blessing to me and I really appreciate it because um, I've had some disappointing things happen with uh, music this year for me, and so I started my page in a reaction to that, just like kind of on a whim, and um, it's just, it's been really great, so I, I love doing it, and I'll keep doing it, so um, I hope you guys have a great holiday, whatever one you're celebrating, I will be celebrating Christmas, so Merry Christmas to all of you, but Happy Holidays to everyone who doesn't celebrate Christmas, and yeah, just stay safe, and I will talk to you guys again soon, okay? Thanks, God bless, bye!